right, uh, welcome back to another adventure. Uh, today, I am back down this rabbit hole here. <clears throat> A bunch of dirt falling down that way. Um, so, came in here. I'm gonna show you guys around a little bit more. And uh, I dropped some materials down here to uh, hopefully build a ladder up to those two little cross cuts. So we'll uh, see what we can show you today. So here's a little better look around. That's the way I came down. Um, big old stope up that way. We had a couple of pillars in here. And then uh, right down that way is where I'm headed. I don't think you can see that. Oh yeah, that's that hole right there, I think. Uh, is that cross drift so I'm going to try and I brought some two by fours and some scrap down here I'm going to try and build a ladder up to those two little cross cuts and uh, see what else I can show you I really like to get over to that side of it um, but we'll see what we can do tonight all right uh, so I'm down here at the bottom that's uh, the route I came down big stope above me um, there is a passageway that way pocket something um there's a there's a nice uh ore chute right up there which um means this was probably a hull level at some point there's the uh what i think is the plugged up bottom of the stope and then there's this um and uh, i came in just threw together this quick little quick and dirty ladder oh hey I'm gonna get that set up a little better. It just twisted pretty good on me. So I'll get that set up and uh, show you guys what's All going right, on. So uh, this is the first one. I got my ladder kind of precarious there. I thought that one was gonna be a little lower. I don't know if I'll be able to get in there with my ladder, but there's some sort of air door or something. And uh, it might take a left there. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, but behind me, there's a tunnel. Um, might just be backfilled at the surface right here. I don't know. It might have been the entrance. Um, nothing in here. Whew. Yeah, I've been uh, been waiting for this one. Dreaming about how it's going to get in here. And yeah, well, that definitely looks like dirt. Um, Okay, so I think this probably used to go to the surface. That's why it's backfilled with all this dirt, um, which makes sense because uh, the hill kind of slopes down on this side. Um, but yeah, this is the, the first look at that bottom, ah, crap, bottom uh, thing there. God, I wish I could get across there. I might be able to... Uh, might be able to do something, I don't know. Might be. Yep, my freaking light keeps crapping out on me. Um, but yeah, my next uh, next thought is to get over there. It's pretty pretty good drop down here though, so I'm gonna have to be careful of it um, while I'm down here. Might need a little more ladder or something. But uh, hopefully I can figure something out. All right, I was, uh, I was able to between the ladder and my rope coming from the top, um, kind of pull myself up into this hole here. There's a, a look down at that uh, stope there. And then that's the level I was just in. And uh, got over to here. That was definitely a, uh, I think there's a pack rat in here. There's, there's a little bit of thumping going on, but uh, I won't bother him too much. In fact, I don't know if that's fur up in that hole there. It might be kind of weird. I think that might be a pack rat. I don't know. <laughs> kind of hiding in the hole there. Um, but yeah, so this is uh, this is probably the the dynamite storage for the whole um, complex here. Get a couple of good pictures of that, and then. Um, Oh, what did I see over here? There's uh, some kind of chute here, I think. Big metal, metal thing here. Oh, that pretty rotten. A little bit of wire. A lot of timbers in here. I'm not sure if those were pulled or um, 
I'm going to keep going this way. Hoping, since this is so hard to get to, it might have some cool stuff in it. There's uh, a little bit of strap rail there. Um, nailed to that board so they didn't have real rail. There's a little bit of the the quartz vein there. And, um, oh, it might face out right there. I don't know, but that quartz pretty cool looking. Uh, all banded right through here. Little stringers everywhere. But um, yeah, yeah. I've been trying to get into this for. Oh, it doesn't end to cool. Uh, trying to dream my way into this one for a while now, and I'm finally, finally in here, able to check it out. Looks like we might have a branch and a stope. Oh, cool. Um, let me see. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. Wow. So we're up above. Okay. Let me get my bearings here. Um, there's more stope. Heading up this way. A uh, bunch of rubble here. And what did I see? There's a can there. Axe handle. Or, uh, you know, it looks more like an axe handle than a pick handle. Um, we got some drill steel. That's cool. Another. Uh, Another, another little can there. Wow, yeah. Well, there's a hook in the ceiling right up there. Uh, right there. That black spot there is a hook. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, right about there. There's a big steel hook in the ceiling there. Um, just a bunch of timbers here. Big, big quartz veins. You can see the drill holes in them there. Let me, uh, there we go. But yeah, so this is, wow, this is coming back at that stope from the other side. This is amazing. Well, I'm guessing I came from up that way. I don't know if this is a uh, false floor or what. I think it's the bottom of the stope. Um, I do where I can get to here. I'm trying to get over here because this is, I think, the top of where I just came in at. Oh, it's just cool. Oh, yeah. So there's the entrance way over there where I dropped in. And then we'll go up and over this. It's kind of blue. Huh, that's interesting. Almost concrete, but look at that vein. It goes all the way up there. There's a ladder, could have used that. Uh, probably not, but <laughs> mine's not quite as nice as that, but it did it, did the job. So there's my ladder that I made where I came in. So we're getting into the, the uh, vertical part of the thing here. I'm gonna scramble up to right there and see what it does and uh, get back. All right, so I'm back over here. This is the way I came in. Um, this is that far end of the stope here. It looks like it all just goes up from there. And then uh, this is a big pillar uh, that goes over to there too. Um, saw these on the way in, but I missed, uh, there's a little bit of track right here and a, uh, dynamite box either lid or bottom there i'm sure there's probably some more pieces around here somewhere what's that oh a track tie or a, yeah the straps to tie two pieces of track together uh which is kind of odd they must have had it just in the intersection here because uh i found that strap rail back there a little ways um oh, there's a bone all the way back in here huh i bet oh losing the light again there we go. I bet that was fun getting down in here for an animal. Um, the stope kind of keeps going around. You can see those veins. That is, that is just nuts. 
Um, get some pictures while I'm back here. Uh, almost looks like a fault here because it's, yeah. Oh, there's a bunch of slab hanging here. I'm not going to hang out too much. Um, get up in the stope a little ways. Okay, it keeps going that way. That's a rotten timber. A little bit of stope here. And, uh, boy. Yeah, a little bit of timber and stuff here. Almost looks like this is kind of bigger, bigger waste rock they were trying to pile back here. So I'm thinking this might be getting close to the end. Oh, it keeps going that way. No daylight. So I'm going to drop down in here and uh, see where it goes. All right, so... Yeah, it does look like it's going to dead end here. Um, this is where I came through at. You can tell all the the rocks pretty big here, like they were dumping the backfill. A little bit uh, exploratory or whatever, and then didn't prove out, so they just piled all their waste back here. Uh, yeah, it looks like it dead ends there. Uh, well... Yeah, that's definitely what happened. Um, you can see it goes back a little ways there. But it's all backfilled with pretty good sized rock. Um, I don't know. Yeah. That's all she wrote. But uh, definitely, definitely glad I got in here. Because this, uh, this is what I was hoping for. So hopefully... Uh, Let's get through this again. Uh, yeah. Back up into this big stove and take another look around here. Oh, oh. license plate back here. It's kind of odd. Like a not that, not that old either. But uh, yeah, take a look at that. Take a look around a little more, and uh, I'll show you guys if I find anything else cool. All right, so I guess it's a uh, that's pretty old. Uh, I don't know if I can get the right angle on it, but it looks like it says 1947 there, Washington uh, truck and FY29. Seven, pretty cool. Um, uh, looks like there's some kind of pack rat or something bigger, maybe even, maybe a cat, I don't know. Nice little den right there with some bones and stuff. Big bone right there, bone there. But uh, I'm sure that's probably the only thing that's agile enough to get in here. And uh, hopefully it's out. Out and about. This is not. Oh, this is too bad. Oh, that goes up to. Oh, almost looked like it went up to daylight. It probably did at one point. Um, I don't think I'm gonna get too high up in here. Um, but uh, that's about the the top of it there. I don't think there's any. Yeah, don't look like there's any tunnel going off of it. Um, but, uh, oh, I need to make my way down, back down this. And uh, probably make my way up and out of here now that I know uh, what's going on with it. And I can finally, uh, after about two years, check this thing off my list, uh, knowing where it goes. Um, yeah, if I, uh, see anything else worth noting, I'll, uh, fire it back up. All right, so I, uh, oh, there he is. There's the tail of him, that pack rat. He was, uh, poking out at me over here and, uh, kind of scrambled a little bit when I 
peeked my head in there, but uh, yeah, so that's the way I came from. That's where the rest of that big soap is. And this is the way I came in. So hopefully it uh, goes as well going out as it did coming in. Thanks for watching.